day all welcome back to long live rock with me lad from the woods where we bring new classic rock from the bands of the past and new classic rock from the bands of now well <clears throat> this is a new band only that one i think for sure uh they're called d-o-g they're uh they're a brand new band like only a couple years old i guess because there's only a couple albums anyways this is brand new it was out december the 9th the album uh it's called new way of life and uh, um, how about I let the band speak for themselves? Because if you know what rock and roll should sound like, you're about to hear it. Anybody that's older, like us boomer types and Gen X and all that, you're going to smile from ear to ear. You younger ones, especially the ones that are into the new uh, classic rock, you're going to absolutely do one of these because they have it. God, I wish this was the 70s with real radio again. God, I'd apply for a job. As long as I had new bands like that, like being able to use the internet and all that shit. Uh, no radio station do that nowadays. Let a DJ just do his thing, man. Like Johnny 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 Fever from WKRP. That's, that's a real DJ. Anyway, even on a TV show, he's more of a DJ than anything. He's been out for 50 years. So anyways, uh, let's shut me up and let's put them on. The song has got a song is called I Got Living to Do. That last line that he sang, I ended up blurting out Johnny Be Good because this song is obviously based on Johnny Be Good. But there's a chorus in there that I kept thinking Johnny Be Good and I didn't mouth it because I'm like, no, that's not that song. But I couldn't help it at the end. It was just like automatic Johnny Be Good. And I'm like, fuck. So there you go, boomers. The rock and roll still being made out there. Huh? That's... uh you know, the beginning of the Beatles sound, uh, of course, with today's technology, um, Chuck Berry, you know, the, the super greats, like the legends, the icons, you know, um, I would really like to know that Chuck, Chuck hasn't passed away. 
No, we would have been hearing about it forever. No, he's still around. So uh, I wonder if he's heard this. I, I imagine uh, it'd be interesting to see what he would say because he's uh, a man who speaks his mind, and uh, that's that. So you either like it or you don't. He don't care. So, but yeah, I mean, just about every great rock and roll song is based on Johnny B. Good. I mean, all the guitarists in the world want to be doing, I mean, that's one of the songs that every guitarist learns the first time. Like one of the first songs they learn along with Smoke on the Water, you know, and then they kind of spread out from there. And, uh, but yeah. <laughs> huh? You couldn't find more pure rock and roll than that. And it's not meant to be uh, meant to be played quiet, kiddies. That's, uh, you know, even you boomers. Well, us boomers, we have to turn it up super loud now. You know, too many uh, Who concerts, Deep Purple, Led Zeppelin concerts, the ears. Woo. Anyways, uh, but you young ones, it's not background music. Rock and roll was never meant to be background music. Okay? Folk, yes. And if I classify folk rock under big rock, well, that's the thing. But... Rock and roll, you know, guitar, bass, drums, keyboards, whatever, lead singer, you know, and so on. It's meant to be played loud on a good system. And you can literally encircle yourself as if you're sitting with the band. And that's how we all listened to music back in the day. I remember when my cousin Keith got his first Bose 901s. And I mean, he put them, he, he, they were, he was staying in, our, well, him and his brother, my cousin Jeff, and uh, his dad had moved up here, but they didn't find a place yet, so they were staying with us for a while. And uh, fuck, we had good times. But Keith set up his sound system in the basement, and we'd all go down there and sit there and put on with the Bose 901s and everything, and it'd be just like, you're floating in the sound, man, it was so good. And... Uh, 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 all the albums that were brand new when we were sitting there listening to them, Pink Floyd, Dark Side of the Moon, Wish You Were Here, Quadrophenia, Who Are You, uh, The Wall, you know, Led Zeppelin's One, Two, Three, Four, Five, you know, Four, and, you know, Houses of the Holy, uh, Sticks. Anyway, I'm doing a Dazed and Confused movie thing here. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I think we pretty much know who this influence is. This band has many different sounds, so don't we won't be pegging them, okay, into one thing. You'll see as we start playing their music. And uh, they should be great ones. Damn, 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 you know. Okay, well, that's okay. We're going to help them get big. Do whatever we can. So, I'm doing whatever I can, little as it is. But uh, if I can turn on one more person to a song like that from a band like this, then, you know, maybe they turn on three, four, and then that's how it starts. And then kids that first hear this when they're young, you know, might be influenced, uh, instead of being a wannabe stripper pop star, they might want to do something different, you know. <laughs> I have my opinions on, uh, on certain things. Again, it's to each people's life, but if you've got to use tits and ass to make yourself big, I mean, Janis Joplin never did <laughs> You know, didn't need to. It was there, it was in her, there, and it was here. And it connected these two, you know. And then she got lucky, she got a band that went, oh, yeah, that works. So that's how it's done, people. And you can do that and pop without showing your tits and ass. And actually play instruments and write your own music. That's what rock and roll is about. So anyway, like I say, it's not my music, it's theirs, and that's fine. They can have their music and we'll have ours so all right i think i've said this already i went on a tangent here thanks for coming okay uh if you um did i already do all that other stuff i must have and i just started talking off the end of it again never mind see y'all later <laughs> i don't even remember damn weed <laughs>